don't really know what Noelle does yet. I guess she has a two-handed greatsword. Slow though. Don't mind me harvesting in the middle of the battle. So that. Go, go. Just stand there. How oh, great. Okay, don't don't climb. <laughs> what? 
aerial attack. That's super cool. Right, we um, restore health through cooking, so maybe I should make some dishes. Oh, I can do more quantity. Auto cook. Alright, we're going on to the second temple now. Uh-oh. Yeah. I'm sorry. You guys aren't strong enough for me to acknowledge. Get at this archery thing. But, okay, that was the first time I hit him. Found a way to like get more stamina or something. You've arrived. Come closer. Can you smell that? I do not want to get closer to this weirdo. Something must have happened in the temple. I imagine there will be slimes, hilly churls, and whatever is giving Storm Terror extra power. Oh yes. It is going to be lively in there indeed. As bustling as it may be, no, I can't imagine it will be dangerous at all. It's a pity that the Temple of the Wolf has been disturbed by such an atrocity. Let's head in. No one makes offerings to the Four Winds anymore. Yet the old winds never vanish. We need to clear out the temples for the Four Winds. All right, temple number two, let's go. Recommended party level is five. Start. Yeah, yeah. So, um, average, you know, 10, 15 is five. Wow, look at that. Ma quick maths. Ooh, 
We'll start out with uh, Noelle to get her some experience. It's kind of weird that I, all of my playable characters are female. I don't know why that's weird to me. Let me show you how the Knights of Favonius conquer our adversaries. I don't need to be shown. I know how to conquer adversaries. What? I don't want to play as this weirdo. I want to look at my people. Door of Resurrection? Hmm. If I'm not mistaken, the end of the temple should be up there. Wait, how do you know? <laughs> experience. The kind of experience you get after years of dealing with things like this for others. So weird, the things outside are like level, uh... Pretty cool. Of course, they'd give you like someone who does fire and ice. Unless I'm mistaken, you don't seem to have a vision. So, how exactly is it that you're able to channel elemental energy? It was a very strange phenomenon. Phenomen <laughs> uh, something strange happened. I'm going to read all of them. We're dealing with elemental reactions here. disappears after his third hit. Ah, finally, we're here. Seems the path ends here. Let's use the wind currents to fly up. Nice. 
freeze. Freeze it. Cool it. Speaking of, did you know? Storm cool Tear was once one of the four winds. I'm not aware of the exact details. If you're interested, you can ask the acting Grand Master about it. This feels like chemistry class. Is that the thing that Storm Terror is using to gain its uh -oh. power? Seems probable. Let's deal with it. Get moving. I would love to frozen in place after all. Get moving. We're not frozen in place after all. We are because my microphone was falling. Bravo. What a performance. What? You did all the work, dude. You are, to my surprise, a well trained knight. The battles you just fought were sights to behold. I see you already have the knightly virtue of modesty. Stories of your heroic deeds to save Mondstadt from destruction shall be known throughout the City of Freedom, well into the future. Please do visit me at our headquarters when you have the time. I also know a lovely tavern, if that's more your thing. So weird, I feel like there are 16 year old children or something. No? We've seized another temple from Storm Terror's grasp. I can take care of the rest here. You go take care of other things while I'm at it. See you later then. Bye-bye. I don't trust him. There's no way hilly turtles organize an ambush like this themselves. Not with their limited mental capacity. <laughs> Thus you were behind this. Thus. Must be some other weird creature. What? Okay. Knights of Aphonius, always so inefficient. Agree to disagree, but your involvement in this just made things a whole lot more interesting. Why do I not trust that dude? That these temples are way too easy. Oh, I'm looking forward to this. I feel like I did absolutely nothing. Whatever, let's go to the third temple. Am 
when I'm too lazy to actually jump down there, we'll just sit up here and... That literally does no damage to the rock. He just like it's cool that he dashes through things, but push your luck. Dodge this. I guess that thing up there is not one of them. Is that a wisp? There's so many ways to get distracted. Do I want to go to that? Kind of. Okay, so I make a shield. I kind of was hoping it was lightning. Potatoes as we smash down our enemies. That barely does any damage.
What's this? to scale the mountain. Stupid stamina. Just so slow. Lisa. Hey, cutie. That's not weird at all. You're going to help me out, too? How kind of you. Don't hesitate to come to me if you need anything. Good question. Basically, things other than that which require brawn or brains. So, what does that leave? Oh. 
Oh, I wanted the mint. <laughs> okay. I guess I could give this a go. <laughs> I knew it. There is a strong elemental energy coming from deep within this temple. Paimon, are you able to float across? What is that dark magic? Can't do much even if she does. Let's ride this wind current, shall we? There's too many playable characters. And he, he, he. Okay, she has a Leave bell, it and it jingles, and that's really annoying. <laughs> that's her belt. It's an electro monument. It with a bit of electro power. Stay on back, sweeties. I will admit, this is pretty cool though. I, I like her power a lot. I guess water when conducts like wet enemies. Yeah, I've got them covered. Yeah, yeah. Come a little closer. Oh, another wind current. Let's ride it up from here. Attack yeah. while flying. Come a little closer. Blitz. Come a little closer. You've been a naughty boy. You say you've been a naughty boy. is only a little less shocking than love at first sight. Oh, you want to know about this gem? You're kidding. You're seriously asking? This is a vision. 
It's used by the Chosen to draw on elemental powers. In terms of mysticism, I suppose you could call it a magical lightning rod. What? You've never seen a vision? Just where exactly are you from? Are you a hilly churl with some level of reasonable intelligence? Wow, that's an no, insult. I doubt it. After all, hilly churls aren't exactly known for their smarts. And you, <sighs> you'd more or less qualify to be a magister's apprentice. Break it, and we can head home and relax. Oh, here's one of those consolidated wind things. <sighs> the thought of putting. Let's head back to the Statue of the Seven Out. Dragon of the East, Lion of the South, Wolf of the North. Falcon of the West. They are the four winds of Mondstadt, affiliated with Barbados, the god of Animo. The Dragon of the East, Storm Terror, its real name is Dvalin. Though most in Mondstadt seem to have forgotten that in all this Storm Terror business. So now you know why Dvalin is only able to channel three of the four winds' power. Because it has been consuming itself from the beginning. It makes because no sense. Because of hatred, I presume. Hatred? Hatred for Mondstadt. Hatred drove it to become something more powerful than the wind itself. To become Storm Terror. But why would one of the four winds hate the city it was supposed to protect? Thank you, Paimon, for making the questions. Uh, as a child of Mondstadt, it's something that's really hard to say aloud. Well, because they probably were terrible to the dragon. Here, take this. It's a very old story from more than a century ago. Well, you should come with me. Paimon will tell you about the rest later. should hopefully be back to normal. Want to go back and see how the knights are doing? But if you've got anything more interesting to do, Paimon can come too. By the way, we obtained another animunculus in one of the Four Winds temples, right? We might come across more of them in the future, so don't forget to offer them to the statues. I have no idea. <laughs> Prologue, Act 1 complete. So, where are my quests? I should never take fall damage because we have the awesome ability to float. Thank you. 
trees. Don't push your luck. Cool it. But who is she racing? Pavel. Wow. I wanted to hit the explosives. Hey! They're not supposed to have good aim. Nice. Offer her all of them? Can you feel the blessings of the seven? In Mondstadt, people. Oh, I guess I did offer all. Statue's eye. 
Some stories say the statue's eyes originally had gems that were taken by swallows, but animaculi never had a physical form from the start. People with visions collect them to offer to the statues as blessings. Unlike others with powers, you don't have a vision. But then the rules of this world don't apply to you anyway, so... <laughs> keep offering animaculi and maybe you'll receive more blessings. Change my party. I'll keep an eye on you. Alright, there's some crystal thing over here somewhere, but I don't know where. We're right on top of it. Give me more stamina. I don't want to do it all to the same statue because I don't know. it
you down. Maybe this guy wants to talk. Oh, he's a knight of Favonius. Ah, oh, it's one of the temples. I feel like the menuing for um, quests is kind of weird. To the adventurous guild. You've had your eye on her, eh? Has she been causing some mischief? <laughs> oh, that is not what I meant at all. Being on the lookout Super for great dehydrated. adventurers is part of. When I look at you, I see one with the potential to rival the great adventurers of legends. Paimon sees it too. Paimon uh -huh. always feels safe adventuring with her. <laughs> Nevertheless, to the adventurer, experience is far more precious than potential. You must accumulate adventurer experience to increase your adventure rank. I think I already kind of understood that. Time is of the essence. Allow me to brief you on... Wait, are you saying we're like official adventurers now? Do not worry. The Adventurers Guild does not charge a membership fee or impose any kind of duties on its members. In short... There are lots of benefits, but no drawbacks to becoming a member. <laughs> Give me the benefits now. <laughs> New recruits these days certainly do not beat around the bush. Basically, the Adventurers Guild rewards you every time your adventure rank increases. Here is a new member's gift for you. You will need to return here to claim. Getting so much stuff. All right, we're at adventure rank Without seven. Ado, please allow me to officially welcome you, our new avid adventurer, into the guild. I'm a guild member now. Here is your adventurer handbook. A new <sighs> member coming aboard is a momentous occasion. A little ceremony is only fair. It has a record of available commissions and rewards, and it is also proof of your membership. Oh, and one more thing. Sometimes you will find yourself stuck at a certain adventure rank. When this happens, you need to perform some impressive feats to gain further recognition from the guild. Impressive feats? Sounds like hazing to me. <laughs> hazing is illegal. They are simply specific adventures that allow you to ascend to the next adventure rank on completion. Ascension adventures, if you will. But that will come later. Opportunities to win recognition will come as you gain more adventure experience. That will do for today. We will have plenty of chances to meet again in the future. Ad Astra Abyssosk, adventurer. With effort, you shall reach the stars and conquer the abyss. Ad Astra Abyssosk. That's not a mouthful or anything. Oh. I guess money. Yeah, I'm killing it. Ranking up, I don't even know what I'm doing.
thick slice of soft white toast topped with a generous <laughs> serving of onion slices lightly caramelized by the toasting. Yum, yum! Paimon's made up her mind! It's an emergency. We must order ourselves a generous serving of fisherman's toast from Good Hunter. Pronto! It's on you. Wow. Thanks, Paimon. So delicious! Good Hunter's fisherman's toast is the best! This might surprise you, but it's actually a classic Mondstadt recipe that anyone can cook. You can try cooking it yourself if you have the ingredients. Can your cooking skills surpass that of Good Hunter's? Why, Paima would love to be your personal taster. Don't you let me down! There's a strange wonder. Gosh, I honestly don't know if I care about any of these. So weird because he's in my party right now. This is bad. Such a hassle. Oh, thank the thousand winds. Your arrival must be the grace of the gods. If I may ask, envoy sent by the animo god to save this mere mortal, could you spare a moment? Ew, cut it out. Yeah, he is being weird. I cannot let my peers hear about this. I cannot seek help from anyone else but you. Way to flatter me. Please. Let us move to somewhere more fit for such conversations. Let's talk in the courtyard, just outside headquarters. Come with me. What's with the sneakiness? Secret pirate treasure? <sighs> Making us go back and forth those loading scenes. Cryo plus hydro equals frozen. So wet and ice. Makes sense. This place will do. Yes, it will. Tell us what it's about already. How should I begin? Oh, right. Let me tell you a secret first. It's a secret of my past, and I confide in you to keep it. I'm not very good at keeping secrets, though. Don't worry. My lips are sealed. I wouldn't trust Paimon either. As a matter of fact, my grandfather was a pirate. Oh. Terrible secret. Wait, why do you sound so blithe? Do you think I'm making it up? It's, just, it's not a secret about him, it's about his family. Look at my eye patch. <laughs> I inherited it from my grandfather, and this <gasps> is solid proof that we are related by blood. My, how could you not know such common knowledge? <laughs> I thought maybe he just only had one eye. This is no different from children inheriting their hairstyles from their parents. Yesterday, I was glancing through the notes my grandfather left and stumbled upon records that spoke of a treasure. Treasure? According to his notes, 
the treasure is buried in the lost Arcadian ruins. Treasure. But the location of the ruins is currently unknown. I've tried searching for clues. Treasure. Treasure. Kaya, what kind of treasure is it? Gold? Or better yet, gems? <laughs> Treasures that consist of nothing but gold and gems are third-rate treasures. I don't know about that. My grandfather's treasure is a sword. Uh, I mean, I could use a new sword. A magic sword that grants the wielder unrivaled power. Oh, wow! The sword was dropped from Celestia into the sea by a god. <sighs> it was later salvaged by my grandfather's crew by pure coincidence. The moment he gripped the sword, thunder roared. Billows howled, and the clear skies were suddenly swallowed by raging winds. With the might of the magic sword, my grandfather went on to defeat a hydra, a silver-haired banshee, a wicked abyss dragon. But the immense power of the sword enticed many more greedy pirates. To avoid meaningless conflicts, my grandfather hid the magic sword. The world we live in is fascinating. Full of unknown and inexplicable wonders. Holy moly, that's just insane! A gang of treasure hoarders has been very active lately, and many ruins have had their relics stolen by them. I'm afraid that they will soon discover the Arcadian ruins. And the magic sword will be lost. We won't let it fall into the wrong hands. We must get the sword before them. You just rest assured that we are here to help. Wow. Great. Please keep it a secret. I'll wait for your good news. Hey, so what you think? Isn't it exciting? We're talking about a super duper powerful sword. Is it well, really, really true? Let's go to the Adventurers Guild and see if we can find out more. The adventurers should know more about the ruins, right? Wait, this isn't the Adventurer's Guild. thought the Adventurer's Guild would be right where the receptionist was. Hmm. We're not here for something that boring. We are looking for a sword that fell from Celestia. One that can kill eight-headed banshees and silver-haired hydras. It's super mega uber powerful. It's fine as long as Paimon doesn't tell them the treasure's location. So, Cyrus, do you know where the lost Arcadian <laughs> ruins are supposed to be? Wow. Arcadian ruins. Thanks for your intel anyway. If you do find these ruins, I'd love to see them. Uh, my intel? Well, wow, that guy's not sketchy at all. Still no clues. Well, it's not like it's gonna be easy. Come on, it's the hiding place of the super amazing sword. Anyway, we should go meet up with Gaia first. Right, we should go tell him that he definitely didn't keep his secret. <sighs> Do you have news for me? No, nothing. Nothing good. Listen, we asked around the Adventures Guild and found... Well, nothing. <laughs> that much is expected. Why is that? Oh, I only mean that what's the fun in finding it without the hard work? However, I do have some clues. I sent someone to collate black market intel. 
it seems that someone does know about the Arcadian ruins. They should not be dabbling with the black market. Really? Where's the guy? Now, now, as per the black market's rules, they will send someone to meet us to prevent leaks. We will be meeting the informant at the Whispering Woods. Then what are we waiting here for? That's right. You read my mind. I am a knight, so I shouldn't have any dealings with the black market. Very true. You have my thanks. Of course, you'll be compensated for your troubles by the knights. Oh, no problemo. My gosh. That looked just like the dude that was lurking with his ponytail. To the whispering woods. This doesn't lead us on like our wild goose chase. Just give me the information. <gasps> Look! this happening to me <laughs> i shouldn't have helped him vile vile crocodile and who? thanks so much for saving me you're far more reliable than those favonius guys it's nothing she's a traveler she has to do with stuff like this all the time traveler i've heard stories about you i didn't think i'd be saved by the one i'm here to meet oh so you're the <laughs> I didn't know how I could pay you back initially, but now I think I'll just give you the intel for free. Yes, I love free information. People in our circle know how important the network is. Lucky? Lucky? But it's lucky for Kaya, isn't it? He's supposed to pay for the intel. Listen well then. The intel on the Arcadian ruins. Why don't we just tell... Like... Gaia that we uh, had to pay on his behalf, so then he pays me more money, right? Three six-armed giants reside in the city in the lake. Two guard the statue, one the treasure. Right. L wait, is that it? There's also this map that came with it. That's not really a map. It's more like a painting. Could this be the experts the spot so the clue is more like a riddle well should be a piece of cake for you right i'm gonna lead you to it then well if you can't solve <laughs> it we can ask kaya he seems like a nerd too wow she just called me a nerd i mean yeah i know i am but I'll still i'll give you the intel so you can review it at any time thanks vile three six arm giants reside in the city in the lake to guard the statue, one, the treasure. What does that mean? If you don't want to ask Kaya, you better figure it out. All right, we have a clue. How do we access our clue? Hmm. 
Hmm. Alright, this is the wish menu. What? I guess you get to try out different characters or something? I kind of like the basic four that they give you. How am I ever going to pick who to actually play? Wow, is that little... I swear, these things just don't die. on level 80. It's going to be awesome. Interesting, weird challenge thing. Okay. <laughs> Oh, 
All right, so this is where I'm gonna leave you guys off for now, where we are going to be working on this quest next, so. Now we're gonna try to keep our episodes to around an hour ish long and whatnot, so. All right. Bye.